Hi everyone, welcome to Food and Spices. Today we'll be showing you how to make pide, also known as Turkish pizza, or stuffed flatbread. If you want video Urdu, then click on the link below. Let's go see what ingredients we need. To make the pie dough, we will be needing these ingredients. 6 cups of plain flour, 1 tablespoon of sugar, 1.5 teaspoon of salt, 1 tablespoon of dry active yeast, 2 tablespoons of olive oil, 2 to 2 and a half cups of lukewarm water. To make the dough, we can start by adding the yeast to the lukewarm water, then add the sugar. Now gently mix and let it sit for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, the yeast solution should look something like this. First, we can start by adding the all-purpose flour to a bowl. Now add the salt and gently mix the two together. Now we can add the yeast solution and the olive oil. Now mix these ingredients together to form a dough. Here we have used a stand mixer, but you can also do this by hand. Once the dough is done, you can transfer it to a greased bowl and cover and let it sit for one hour. While the dough is proofing, we can move on to the beef topping, for which we will be needing 350 grams of ground or minced beef, one medium-sized onion, diced, two to three diced tomatoes, one teaspoon of crushed red chilies or per your taste, one teaspoon of red chili powder, half teaspoon of salt, 5 to 6 cloves, 2 to 3 green chilies, 1 tablespoon of ginger garlic paste, 1 tablespoon of olive oil. We can stir up by heating up oil in a pan on high heat. Then add the onions and cook them for 2 to 3 minutes. Then add the minced beef and the ginger garlic paste and let it cook for a few minutes. After 5 to 6 minutes, the water released from the beef will start to dry up. Then we can add the red chili flakes, the red chili powder, the salt, cloves, and the tomatoes. Now mix everything together and let it cook for about 5 minutes. Then you can add the green chilies and cover and let it cook on low heat for 5 minutes. And there it is, our beef topping is now ready. Now we will put aside the toppings. We will need the beef that we cooked earlier, cheese, one large egg, 
and butter. Butter is only used at the end once the pide is ready. Now we can prep the dough. Here you can preheat your oven to 400 to 450 Fahrenheit. Start by sprinkling some dry flour onto your work surface and divide the dough into 8 equal pieces. Once they are divided, you can roll out the dough vertically as shown here. Once the dough is rolled out, you can add the topping of your choice or 4-5 to five tablespoons of the minced beef. Once you have added the topping of your choice, you can fold the dough inwards into a boat shape or as shown here. Here we are just making the cheese pide. Now they go into the preheated oven for 8 to 10 minutes. You can add the egg to the cheese or the beef pide. If you would like to add the egg, you can add it in 4 minutes after the pide has been in the oven. As it comes out of the oven, add the butter on top and serve. And there you go, our delicious pide is now ready to eat. Pide is known for its creamy texture and meaty flavor. The main difference between a pide and a pizza, other than shape, is its sauce. There is no tomato sauce used in a pide. We hope you enjoyed the video and will give this recipe a try. Don't forget to like and subscribe for new recipes. Thank you for watching.